Hello everyone, welcome back to another Premiere Pro tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create an x-ray effect or a flash type, strobe type look effect just like this. And these are three different styles I've chosen for you uh, just to give you examples. Of course, you can just select one of them, but let me show you how to do this really, really quickly. So let me just go ahead and delete everything. Start from scratch. It should take about 90 seconds at, or so. All right, drag and drop some footage into the timeline. Beauty. Now let's zoom in a little bit. All right, good. Pick a part, pick a place where you want the strobe to to begin. So for me, let's start at the five second mark. Okay, good enough. So the playhead's at five seconds. Now I'm going to go down to the project panel, click on the new item, and I'm going to click and create an adjustment layer just like that. Presto. I'm going to click on OK. It's now the same dimensions as the footage on the timeline. Drag and drop the adjustment layer onto the second video track here. And now here comes the easy part. We're just going to zoom in a little bit more so you can see this. And then presto. All I'm going to do is I'm going to press the right key twice. And then I'm going to hit Command K if you're on a Mac, Control K if you're on a PC. And we're basically cutting the adjustment layer. I'm going to hit the right key again two times, Command K, Control K, and then you guessed it one more time. Command K and Control K after you press the right arrow key, uh, right arrow key twice. So we've made three cuts here. So we've got three sections. Good. I'll delete the rest of that adjustment layer. We don't need it. Now, I'm going to go ahead and make this, I'm going to just space this out a little bit. So I'm going to add a little bit of distance in between the cuts so that we've got it. We've got an adjustment layer and then we've got some frames, adjustment layer, some frames. I think it's two or three frames. It doesn't really matter. I just want to show you the effect. Okay, let's get going. The next step, you want to go to your effects panel. For me, it's located right here. If you don't see it, go to window. Make sure there's a check mark beside effects. Type in the word invert, which I've already done here, into the effects panel or into that little search bar, and you'll get effects, you'll get the invert effect. Drag and drop it on the first of the adjustment layers. It doesn't do anything yet, but now watch. Watch what happens here. Bang. X-ray. We've got a neat little X-ray effect. Very cool for music videos. On the second one, we're going to drag and drop it again on the second one, but this time, instead of selecting the default, I'm going to click on it again. Watch this. You can go, instead of having RGB, you can just have it set to red or green or blue. You guessed it. And even these other ones, like the HLS, you get very, very cool, neat, different appeal. Like this is She-Hulk, right? Right out of that uh, TV show. Get the She-Hulk effect right there. That's all you got to do to create an X-ray effect or a flash strobe effect in Premiere Pro for music videos. Thanks for watching.